Hello and welcome back again to Ruin Arc. I've had a blast with this game recently. I'm uh, having a whole lot of fun getting to try out and experiment with new different things. And most excitingly, we have another update coming uh, the month of December 2020. So excited to have that going on, but I'm not sure what exactly it's going to entail and what's going to change. I'm pretty sure that some things, I don't know, nerfed might be the wrong word, changed. Some things that are too effective to screw over the citizens or maybe spells that are too impactful and don't give enough threat like a meteor i feel like should do as much as a world as a tornado if not more i don't know but uh let's see what have we done so far hey iris we've done pangit lu if i'm saying that right una how about we move on to this one right here because i think this would have been the next one before i fought or maybe it's that one, I don't know. But this situation is a small but powerful elven tribe. Almost all of them are blessed, and almost all of them are robust. Except for one evil elf among them that can be the key to shattering the peace, which, I don't know. That sounds... Mm, it sounds good. I don't know if it's going to be the path we pursue, because that is... Well, I guess I haven't done the hands-off path, have I? So I will be doing that this time. Let's go ahead and get that set up as soon as we can get into setting them up. I kind of wish they had a more ambiguous demon, because it kind of makes the Ravager seem like the uh, the front man for the entire thing, you know? Like his art, his world, and all that kind of stuff. Anyway, they're tucked over here in this bottom right corner. Uh, very elfy. Man, they really lean into it, don't they? And then there's a camp or something in like a dilapidated temple. I don't want to be particularly close to either of these, but I definitely don't want to be close to the elves in their little corner over there. So let's go ahead and throw my portal down. And we are going to run with the Puppet Master. The Puppet Master is a little bit, well, well I mean, you can be hands-on with, like, meteors and rain and stuff like that. But let's see Let's see what we have access to. Hold on. Let's get all of that out of here, Chip. We actually have to work with. Get rid of that and that. All right, Lust Demons. AoE debuff that lowers mood. AoE debuff that prevents them from moving. And a guard for the portal. All right. We're stuck with the Eye and a Defiler. So that'll help with the one evil elf that they have. Uh, can't see his villagers because they're blessed, so also you cannot zap them either. Which means our best way of handling the situation would probably be to uh, ignite stuff can burn objects. That could be cute. Maybe that'll be a thing we go for. We could also agitate monsters or seize monsters to throw into maybe a kennel. We don't have snatch as one of our abilities over here. I think that's unique to the Lich, so even if we were to raise the dead, we couldn't do anything with them except guard our structures, which means that a prison would not be great. Also, Biolab wouldn't be great, so we're going to go with Kennels. That works with our Seize Monster. Sucks that three of our abilities are going to be almost a non-factor, but at least we'll have the ability to seize objects and monsters, so we have a little bit of hands-on. Again, all of these right here don't really do anything. For obvious reasons, so that sucks. We get something we can do, maybe. Let's see. Mm. Good old vampirism mixed with gluttony. If we can get uh, something going on with like more migrants in the area, maybe. And now that we've got that all figured out, how about we bring in? Let's see. Maybe the forlorn spirit. No, maybe not. Looks like it's a um, what you call it situation. A very cold one. So how about we throw some water around? This is for using water. Why don't we bring some lightning and we can use food to set up traps, which is cute. Hmm. We can also just throw a snare trap down, locusts to eat whatever food they have, landmines. Landmines don't generate threat, they cost a lot. Then we're going to go with the forlorn spirit to drain happiness from people, because that'll lower their mood. And maybe if we can't get the, uh, the one evil elf on our side particularly uh, quickly. That will help with lowering her mood and setting that up. So, what do we got going on? We got this little village over here. Uh, we can go ahead and let you start. Everyone get moving, doing their thing. Go ahead and do our build. Let's throw the eye... Uh, uh, just over here by the lake. Didn't really have to be close to us. Prison. Again, we can't really do anything with it, but at least we have it. And then we can throw the kennel right here for monsters. Kennel will be good. Matter of fact, hold on. What do we got for monsters? Hold on. We have Ratmen. That's interesting. Hostile to everything except undead who they are neutral with. They're also plagued. They're 
Trait Plague Reservoir. Immune to Plague's effect could spread it. Is that all of you? Ooh, that's interesting. That's very interesting. Their plague spreads through physical contact and consumption, sticks around for days, works on undead, the septic shock, seizures, sneezing, and on death turns them into zombies. So, that is very interesting. I mean, here's just like a whole zoo, I think. Uh, zoo cell? Yep, called it. Zoo cell lets them, uh... And they got the pick of the litter, don't we? Oh, I do love my giant spiders, so we're gonna go ahead and grab one of those. That's not the kennel. This is. Go ahead and get those set up. Breed them. Uh, what else did we want? Do we have anything else? No, of course not. Uh, ghosts do not stick around forever. Fire elementals burn down nearest village or occupy a special structure. I like the idea of going after their uh, homes. That sounds pretty good as well. We'll get some of those. I mean, all kinds of stuff going on over here already. And then, let's see. Sprightly disables people. Immediately dies after you do that. Ice Nymph. Defender. Well, speaking of, we should go ahead and probably throw down some of our demons. We have more demons than I thought we were going to have. By and far. Strange. Happy about it, though. Right, Gluttony to guard us. Uh, we'll throw another demon near the eye? Nah, in the kennels. You can guard the kennels. Why do we have so many demons? I think we're actually having some sort of a glitch. Because we have, uh... Well, three demons that can all invade. These are all supposed to be for the, um... Well, what you call them? The Ravager Demon. So that's interesting to note. wonder what, what's causing that to happen. Not really worried about it. Let's check these guys out. Peaceful, exclusive to elves, nature worship, yada yada, crimes, vampires, and demon worship. No? Okay. <laughs> Relations, hostile to rat men, hostile to undead. I don't really care about vagrants. Like, nothing special going on with the town yet, so. Let's find that evil one. Oh, shit, that was fast. Uh, zero faction, location. There's your house. This is you right here, huh? Right there. Looks like he had a wife. Fireproof, hates music, less damage from fire attacks. That's actually really useful since we're going to be raising fire monsters. Got a wife we can probably preach to. What's your mood looking like there, son? Pretty high. We can lower their overall happiness, which I believe is entertainment. So let's go ahead and give him the yoink and send him to the brainwashing cells. Did we not click the right ones? Oh, shit. <laughs> Never mind. We don't even have that. Uh, so I guess we're just going to stick the evil guy in here and uh, torture him, afflict him. Did we not even get the stuff we wanted to get? Huh. What spells do we have? Why are we Ravager? Okay, that makes a lot more sense suddenly. Well, looks like we're doing this the Ravager way after all. If we're going to do the Ravager way. How about we uh, just kind of mix things up? Let's see. Monsters, let's go ahead and throw a bunch of spiders in here. And just really lean into being a horrible monster. Earthquake! Let's see if we can break apart this prison. <laughs> oh, it worked. Well, uh, now all these monsters are free to go do whatever the hell they want to. Which is a whole a lot of fun. Now, we have this evil boy here. Uh, what do we do with him, though? Looks like he avoids the eye, which is pretty good. We can make him afraid of fire, in addition to being fireproof. So if he has a chance of... Uh, Using that to help his fellow citizens, we will shut that down real quick. And now that we've got those working for us, what do we want to do? How about we kidnap a slug? Why not? We'll get a slug. What do slugs do? Spews out poison from time to time as things happen. No, I can handle that. That's fine by me. Why are there worms? This clave was empty. Uh, Let me just pull you out of here. Mr. Worm. And you're going to have to work with somebody else. Uh, didn't there's another heaven to the worm? Another worm cave? There we go. There we are. Now we got everything working together all nice. Exterminate cave 27. I don't know what that is, and that's okay. Well, 
let's see. Do we have access to... No, no rain or anything. We do have locusts. Locusts immediately tear through their food. Screw them. Can't use heat wave in the snow area, which is not fun, but whatever. Uh, how about a few landmines scattered across the place as well? I'm thinking... Let's see. What is this place? Lumberyard? I don't really care. Look over like a hospital, which I think makes me a war criminal. But we're already trying to kill people, so why doesn't might as well lean all the way into it. Landmines and the front doors. Bam. Ooh, triggered and did a lot of damage in an AoE. I didn't expect that to happen so uh quite so quickly. Well, and let's remine it if we can. We'll do we'll do this door, why not? Howl and Terra, the locust storm still scaring people. Got another worm. Are they like moving territory or something? Don't know. We're gonna put one there. To have them all gummed up one area. God, they remind me of um, what do you call it? The uh, old Tremors movies. That's what that reminds me of, and that makes me feel crazy old. What were those? The '90s at this point? Gosh. How many years ago was that now? Do I even want to think about it? Let's grab these sledges. Uh, move down and maybe put them somewhere. Okay, claim them a cave. We'll claim the fire elementals over here to this cave. And the sledges can have this one. And we will grab this other worm and store him away in this cave. I don't know if wildlife will fight each other. I don't think they will. But I like having all of the worms in one spot because they're towers. They can't get kind of really get around. Which, what are you doing, little ice nymph? Everything around them is constantly freezing, isn't it? That's fascinating. Alright, so we got that one trap right there. So we got fire burnt, stuff burning down over there. I don't know what did that. I assume it wasn't the fire elemental, because how would it have gotten there? Oh, never mind, that was in fact a fire elemental that did that. Whoops. Oh, it wasn't one of my lads. Our threat's pretty low, so if we wanted to, we can shake things up a little bit. How about we do some uh, fire and brimstone? Let's see how the town reacts to that. Kind of hoping that it'll melt some things so that we can use our lightning to throw some... Oh, hold on. We got someone losing their mind over here. This is the guy that we threw into prison, the evil one. Why are you so hurt? What happened to you? Uh, fireproof. It wasn't the fire. Definitely wasn't that. Doesn't like crowds, hot-headed, all that kind of stuff. I don't know what's going on with him. I don't really care. Either. Let's just start burning stuff. Burn the potions. Burn the antidotes. Burn the guitars. We don't like music in this land. Uh-oh. Going to extract water from the well. Destroy the well. No water. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're about halfway up, and we're starting to run low. Well, oh, never mind. We're kind of doing a little bit better. My dude has completely lost his mind out here, hasn't he? Are you... No. Okay, he's better now. Which gave us a lot more mana to play around with. I think everyone else is blessed, though. I think it said something about if they're not blessed, they're robust, but I haven't seen a single one. Who is not blessed? Oh! Oh no, that's him. <laughs> oh, made myself sad. Yeah, I can't really do anything with any of them. I can light his chair on fire, or whatever the hell this is. An antidote? Are you sitting on an antidote? How do you apply those things? Oh, well, let's, uh... Wow. Uh, sludge is really populating. We're not populating, we're like throwing the sludge all over the place. I wonder why not, not getting any around the base. Strange. Alright. Another sludge. Looks like the rat men are being taken down by the random stuff that was in the, uh... Oh, whatever. Let's throw the fire elementals down. Oh, no wonder. They busted out of the cage. That's what happened. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. Uh, I'm just kind of gonna light that on fire. See what happens when you light a tombstone on fire. Maybe I'll reveal the thing. Why did this freeze? Didn't I light this on fire? That is the opposite of what fire is supposed to do. Oh, whatever. Let's uh, throw some more landmines down, I suppose. Just kind of there and there. 
and okay, 47. What else do we want to do to these people? Uh oh, what's going on? Looks like that fire elemental is just getting to do whatever the hell he wants to. Whoever lives here is in for a bad surprise when they get home. Hmm. We're not even really playing into the intel, though, are we? Maybe we can do a little bit of that. Who is the person in charge of this place? All right. Uh, they're in charge of some party. Watermaster, blessed, inspiring, and informative. Let's see. Who is the leader? Findia, if I'm saying that correctly. So, Findia, what's your deal? Who do you know? Who do you like? You're having an affair? Well, then, let's uh take that. She became a hero and lost all of her flaws during a miraculous transformation. Excuse me? What's going on? What did you... Jesus Christ! A hungry, blessed, robust, mighty, fast, and... Ha Ooh. Turns out uh, Excalibur is on this map, which makes her hard to deal with even for like a full hands-on monster like I am as a Ravager. Interesting. I'll just put landmines around for now, I guess. Uh, let's go back to the village leader. Hmm. Who was it? Where are you? Alright, so... You tucked away over here. Killed by... Yeah, so they have like a super warrior guarding this place now. Let's do a little filtering just for intel. There we go. That makes this a lot simpler. Alright, Findia, Findia. Get everything about flirting with others. And you know what? I don't even feel bad about this one. I kind of feel like I'm doing the right thing. I think you are... Who's everyone's flirting with everyone else? I believe that's the hero of the town, so I'll grab that information too. I think we have enough uh, intel to start doing some stuff. So, let's see. Findia, who is your actual husband? Is he there? Oh, no. Never mind. That's not how that works. You're having an affair. You're outside of marriage, and you're flirting with the person in the marriage. You fiend. Well, let's go over here and tell uh, this lady about that. Enraged and betrayed, as you should be. As you absolutely should be enraged and betrayed. And that is your husband, and I can tell her about this. And she'll be enraged and betrayed, and the guy in the middle of all of this... Uh-oh, what's going on? Apprehending criminal? What did he do? Restrained... See, proving in combat. What did he do? I can't tell. Oh, he just went... He's been going insane the whole time. That's right. And you are crying for being betrayed. That's going to give me some mana. How about we uh, shake things up a little bit with some brimstone there and there. And uh, whose house do I not like? The lumberyard? Here, we're just do doing that as well. Bam. Earthquake. Maybe that will distract them from doing whatever they want to do to our one guy that we can actually fiddle and play around with. Let's turn the filter off. There we go. More intel. Dragonborn, blah, blah, blah. Do you have... Are you the Excalibur lady? No, you're not. I'm the wrong one. Husband. Oh, her husband flirted with her. Well, I guess I'll just kind of spread that around. Do you care? Yeah, I imagine you don't care. Uh, but Lauren, I don't know what your deal is. Looks like Selenia is dead? Oh my gosh. Oh. Well, there's not a whole lot I can do with that information, is there? They're just... His man's dead wife. Scornful? <laughs> what? Hold on. Why are you scornful that a dead woman was in love with somebody? I, that's, that's, man, that's harsh. I don't even think I'm that evil and I'm supposed to be the devil. A uh, lot of disowned homeless folk running around. It's sad and I don't care that much. Moving on, fire elementals. Grab a couple of them. 
we're doing all in on the fire. You may all be blessed, but I could still have my hand in casting you down. We'll put all three of them in one location in the city. Because being fair is not in our cards. Let's see what else can we do. We can throw a tornado down. I don't really feel like I want to do anything that overt. Uh, landmine there. And landmine... Uh, there. And a little brimstone. Why not? Kind of really lean into the fire and darkness thing that we got going on right here. Bam. Runs onto that. Poison clouds everywhere. Our threat's really high. I feel like I want to do at least a tornado, though. Just kind of wham that down right there. And unfortunately, that destroys the roof and not her. But what can you do? All right, throw another tornado down right there on the well, which we will destroy again. Just kind of... And we're at 98, so now we got to chill for a little bit and watch them deal with the fallout of uh, our little demonic rampage just now. And we'll have to do the Puppet Master next, but we're going to another one on the next one, which is going to be more regions. So that'll be fun to display. Hold on. They went, and they found one of the rats and interacted with it, and now they're spreading the plague amongst themselves, too. And it looks like they're fiddling around with the giant spiders. Not a good idea, friends. Not a good idea. Is the troll dead? Troll not dead. Huh. All right, what is he off to go do then? Place a freezing trap on the floor. Hey, that's interesting. Cannot be frozen. Interesting indeed. Abduct them to some place and then eat them. Hmm. Oh, oh hey, we have some. Uh, we must have got some people migrate in. No, we have people migrate in. Maybe they are not blessed. Let's see, how do we... Yep. We got some new folk in town. What's your deal, homie? Bored, suspicious, chased, all that fun stuff. 17%. No, no, that's not going to be enough. We don't really have anything to do anything about that, though, do we? Spooky locust swarm. How's that do for you? Uh, I need... I wish I had the ghost to make him really get uh, screwed up. No dice on that, though. I'll just leave traps here. For in case they try to move in. And what we can do is afflict him with being hot-headed and some pyrophobia. Flee and cower whenever they see fire. Which, uh, we got a little bit of that. Do we have a f uh, threat of five with brimstone? Sure. Hey, wake up. There's fire everywhere. You serious? Huh. Oh. Uh-oh. I may have overdone it, lads. Uh, where are they at? Divine intervention. A few angels, I'll say, are coming to try and take me away. Uh, how about we breed a few more monsters? Uh, we're gonna want to kind of throw them in the way, kind of screen them between us, and summon a few demons in as well. And hopefully they get between the monsters and us. We got a little bit going right there. How about we do a little bit more direct intervention? Like a lightning blast to a couple of them. Uh, how long would it take a meteor to connect? Uh, I think I may have knocked down them, so maybe I can... Nope, did not work. Okay, so they're going after our stuff. But if they're going to hold still like that, we will gladly hit them with meteors. Maybe they're more weak to lightning? I don't know. Alright, that's one of our buildings burnt down. Uh, they're going for the eye now. Oh, Christ. Alright. Throw the prison back down. Sure. Can I not build while the eye is under attack? I don't know. Um landmine right there and a poison cloud I think the landmine made the poison cloud explode into a huge thing that's fun let's see more monsters that we can use to work with ourselves 
I don't think a giant spider is going to do a whole hell of a lot, but it's something. Let's put our spider over there. What else do we got? Zap. And one more. Yeah. Alright, Angel's down. Oh, Lord. Gotta be more careful. Getting a li little bit too happy with the uh, expenditure of horrid magics. I wonder what's been going on over here in the meantime. Place does not look great. It's not a poison down here. Did I do that? I don't remember doing that. Uh, I thought I lit this on fire, but apparently not. I don't know. Let's you know what? Let's light their bed on fire. That'll feel make me feel better about myself. They buried a sludge. What nice people are. Do they do they worship nature? I totally forget. Yeah, no wonder they're worshiping. Even if they're fighting monsters, I guess they're still trying to make sure that. Oh, I don't know. Something is well and right in the world. You're real happy for someone who is uh in one of the worst states a villager can be. Oh well, let's see. What about you? What's your deal? Are you a vagrant? You are a vagrant. Interesting. And an evil one. Not a whole lot we can do about that though. Where are you going? Why are you why the hell over there? That's one sleepy incubus. Wonder what his deal is. Alright, so we're gonna need some more spiders. That's how we do it. We're gonna put some more spiders in this cave. Just big old spider caves all around here. That's the plan. Uh oh. Shocking events. Assaulting. Restraining intruder. Restrained. What? Oh, he died of the plague. And that plague brings people back as zombies. I totally forgot about that. That's pretty awesome. Oh, we got a tornado. How do we want to use the tornado is my question. Kind of just want to hit them with it actually where is the hero is it you who has Excalibur I thought it was some H name lady it could be horribly wrong strangled himself from a suicidal mental break holy shit ah uh, wow okay that's not what I expected to see super down with it though feel free to do that all day long who has... Who is the hero who has that thing? I'm just gonna just scroll through him real quick. Because I could have sworn it was that one girl I was already looking at. A lot of water flask. There she is. Okay, so Amy is the hero of the town currently. And currently sleeping on the ground. Sur uh, sullied and worried. Sulking and worried, I guess I should say. Well... Whatever, girl. I don't like that you got this whole uh, situation going on with the magical super sword. So we're going to see if we can screw up your life a little bit and throw a tornado at you. Okay, so... Do you have a home? Sulking and hungry. She has a home, but she has nothing there. Hmm. What if we just make you miserable by burning down everything you love? That worked for you. That would work for me. Threat of 15. That's uh, that's very close to being the last straw for this. Uh, so many more things of angels, which I don't think I am quite ready for. Alright, Amy. Just managing to dodge that. What are you doing in this person's house? Intruder! Yeah, you get the hell out of here. That ain't your place. Oh god, I, she's going to be really hard to deal with. I have no plans for that, except, I don't know, an entire spider colony might work. Ooh, that's one of the rats. They buried a rat in there. I wonder if the rats themselves did it or what. Also, is the nice, does the ice nymph automatically go for, like, wizard towers to like, live in? That's super interesting to me. Alright, more sludge monsters. Can always use a couple more of those. Let's put them in the house of the hero too. That sounds fun. What's going on? 
Oh. They're heading into the spider cave. Interesting. Alright, uh... Now that they're in the spider cave, is there anything I can do? I wish I could like, just straight up wall them in. That'd be a whole lot of fun. But I don't think I can. I think I lack that ability. We're making, we can make going out real painful. Apparently blow up part of the walls. Jesus, I didn't know Landmine had that much oomph to it. Run up in, run up in. Run the Landmine there. A little bit under the radar. All my spiders! Feels so terrible. And I guess one right here. No, looks like that's not along the pre-decided path. Oh well. I hear even more violence. Hmm. Well. Oh, it's because the people died from the plague. Ah, oh, sick. Okay, that makes me feel better. We got something going for us. As long as I keep trying to pass what little bit of plague is around back and forth, it'll be good times. Matter of fact, is your grave plagued? No, I think all the rats, their graves and stuff are probably done for as far as that goes. Uh, magical angel warped away. One ghost just hanging out. Spiders didn't really seem to do it, so we're going to seize the spider and just kind of Toss it in here to have fun with itself. And then we're going to breed something else. I got my eye on these kobold. I find it very interesting that he, uh... Well, first off, let's go ahead and agitate this abomination. And it should go get pissed off and go attack a nearby village. Now that we've done that, let's go ahead and get this kobold. And it'll work for us. That's my plan. Start breeding them. Oh, we got a couple of kills, though. That feels pretty good. Alright, you... Still can't do anything with you. 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 Where is the next? Here, just gonna light that on fire. Maybe that'll freak him out a little bit enough. Bellagrand has the plague. One of my only evil compatriots here. Are all the ones that I could actually interact with dead? Because that would be about right, wouldn't it? Oh, maybe. Maybe this one right here. Destroy the bed. No. No, that doesn't work either. Why is your head low? Or your health low? What you got going on? Hungry, exhausted, plagued, evil, fire, blah, 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 all that stuff. Nothing really there that I care about, though. That farm is useless, which is kind of fun. I wonder what they're doing for food at this point. I wonder how long do they devolve into cannibalism. What are you screaming about? Cried grieving. Yeah, that makes sense. Fell into a wormhole and ended up at another wormhole. There are wormholes? What? I did not know that was a thing. So apparently, like, worms can travel? Uh-oh. And what in hell were you doing way over here, son? Ah, oh, shit. Alright, throw the kobolds at them. This is bad. How bad is it? I'm not sure. Just go ahead and throw that there. Magic didn't do a whole lot to them. But we should have demons back to help out with this sort of thing. Yeah, go ahead and go get to work on that. Uh, landmines, I think, are going to be next. Jesus Christ, okay. Well, that didn't work out really well, did it? Stop Valthahorn. He's still going back? Just, what if I do it like that? Okay, he lost track of what he was doing and why he was doing it for, so that works out. Uh, let's see here. Looks like it did a little bit of damage, but not a lot. Throw that down there. Get that going. Hit him with the lightning. Hit him with the second thing of lightning. Hit him with the third thing of lightning. Thank you for all stacking up on the same guy. That really made things a lot easier for me to deal with. Oh, gotta be careful though. Did that again. No, now we can move our eyes somewhere to more aesthetically please ourselves. Let's see. How about down here? 
Apparently near the fishing hole is uh, not a good spot because we had another person walk by earlier as well. Huh? Oh, more giant spiders. I didn't know they were still breeding down there. Not that one abomination who we uh, pissed off and wanted to go do something and got taken down. Oh, let's go agitate a wolf. These spiders can go ahead and just breed themselves into a corner over there. Uh-oh. Let's repair that, because we lost our kobold, I think. No, maybe not. But if we didn't, where is he? Fish pile. That's on fire. You don't want that. Where are we... <sighs> Killed by dude. Alright, so. Let's try that again. Let's re-seize him. Stick him in jail. Apparently we need to... Well, it's already... It should already be fine. Alright, so. Kobolds. Three of them. Uh, we'll keep them in this cave. That'll be their little kobold hold. Everything should be nice and fancy there. Sulking, blessed, authoritative. Giant spider. They can't really seem to get rid of all the giant spiders, can they? Uh, as, as expected, the wolf ravager didn't do a whole hell of a lot either. But that is okay. Here, you know what? You're agitated. Go do something. I was hoping he would turn into somebody, and then he would be able to do the... Uh, one thing that a succubus does, where they will trick somebody into breeding with them and then die, which uh, doesn't appear to be the case, which is a bit of an unfortunate circumstance. Let's see. Earthquake, we'll be five. I'm going to actually let the sledges out if we can get the walls to be broken. That might take a couple of rounds of doing it, though. Mm, I think we do another... Uh, fire elemental next because things are a little bit unstable over here they're actually holding out really well for a bunch of uh rando elves although they are pretty strong to be honest most of them are like blessed and robust and i can't do a lot of hands-on interaction to screw them over uh oh all right okay you're not one of the like crazy ones so that's good at least do a landmine there pop which awoke ints? Excuse me? That's awesome. Hold on. Uh, let's get rid of the sludge, maybe? Give me this int. What does an int do? Defender. Hmm. You know what? We're going to take it anyway. That's fine. Uh, stick it into a cave somewhere. Do we got any local int caves? There we go. And now it's pissed off and stuck around there. I had no idea that there was an int there. Not at all. Destroy this fish, Jesus Christ. No fish, get out of here. Shoo. Alright, seize ant, stuck it in there, just to make sure nothing gets out. Mm -mm, I hear more violence. Looks like the final giant spider finally got put down. Uh, it's a shame. But we do have a cave full of them over here somewhere still, if we ever... Got the desire to chill and hang out with them. Speaking of, let's go ahead and seize this guy. Put this sledge over there. I'm gonna grab an ant. They are... It's... They're devious! Alright, hold on. No. If we ignite it, though. Hey, there you go. Show yourself, you old monster. I'll seize you and throw you into the old slime pit. Be still, by the way, because you will get killed. Alright, Snow Int. Where can we put you? Can't do it like right in towns, obviously, but we can do it pretty damn close. Now the question is, are they going to retreeify themselves? Hey! Defending territory. Who are you going after? The Kobold? Oh, attacking hard, well. Eh, well, you know what? That's fine. Do your thing. You're all still kind of working me for me in the first place. I don't really care how the mischief gets managed. And then we'll do a fire thing next. If we can pull that off. Come on. Come on. We'll have him uh, get set about into here, probably. There you go. 
Thank God we at least have our kennel because uh, we're holding up our threat pretty high for a long time. And I do not want to summon more angels again. That's the most angels, or yeah, it's the most amount of angels I've ever summoned, so I'm not a fan of that happening again. Uh, oh crap. Oh, that was fast. Plus, plus, there's so many words on him. Making me all having a bad time. Oh, well. Alright, the kidnapping is working. I mean, it's kidnapping and then, like, ants are taking people away, but it works. You know, it counts. Grief stricken, hungry, sulking. Yeah, whatever. Don't really care. Uh, how about we throw some locusts to stir things up a little bit? Scare people, get them all screwed up so they want to just kind of hang around and do nothing. And then we'll throw a blizzard down. Let's see if we can freeze over the lake. That'd be interesting, huh? What does it look like that's what's happening? I don't know what she's doing either. Maybe she's going back to help her allies? How do I hope not? Oh, she turned that tree into wood immediately. Good lord. Ugh, oh, man. Alright, so, on fire. She's recovering health. No, no, not recovering health. On fire again. Uh, let's see, what's she going to go do now? Connor's going to the outskirts of town. And there's still another landmine down there. I didn't catch. Oh well. Put enough around the ground all over the place. I'll get eventually. Someone's killed, got turned into a zombie. And the evil man is still there. He is now Oh wait, that's someone else. Who is the Oh don't tell us our like our one guy is actually dead. He had another B name. Where are you? So many dead people. So many dead people. Is this him? Uh, crap. Oh, I think it, it doesn't really matter. Because he wasn't uh, doing what I thought we were going to be able to do, given the situation. Another imp. Up and about, having an angry time. Suicidal. Ooh. That would make things a lot easier. Let's get some more ants. Put them on the outside of town. Or near town or something, at least. Here's a tree. Here's a second tree. We're not doing any of that there. Helpful. Oh man, they really tore him down instantly, didn't they? They turned him just into meat. Goodness. And you know what? In the spirit of these trees doing nasty tree stuff, let's go ahead and just throw demons at them. And like that, like that. Just throw them all out there. And we may be towards the end of getting this village down. If, if, big if, we can... Jesus Christ. If we can do anything about her. She is a monster. I got that going. Smash blew her up a little bit. Zapped her. Zapped her twice. Oh. Oh, that worked. Now, no one else gets Excalibur. Get rid of that. That is totally worth the angel showing up again. I think. Oh, they're they're a lot closer this time. Maybe not. Oh boy. Uh, we're gonna need some. We're gonna need ints. We're gonna need a couple of ints because they are going for the portal immediately. Oh no, mistakes might have been made. Just gonna throw these all around right there. Oh boy. Oh boy. All right. So how do we do this? How do we get rid of these? Okay. Oh. Oh, what? Oh! <laughs> well, well, well. It turns out the invasion force I sent and the destruction of the wilder Excalibur was enough to take out the, uh, take out the village before we lost our portal. Along with the discovery that if we melt the ice, we can immediately start electrocuting it to, uh, stun people that are in it. All very good things to know, and 
I will be using that in the future. But that will be all for today. Thank you for dropping by and checking out Ruin Arc. I'm having a blast. I'm hoping you are too. And if you want to see more of the stuff like this, stick around and check out the channel. I'll see you again. But until I do, take care. And I'll see you next time.